This is verse 27, 13th chapter, Gospel of Matthew. In the midst of the parable, Jesus tells about the uh, sowing of a field with uh, tares, as uh, they're called. Zidzania is the word. It uh, means uh, really a poisonous kind of weed, uh, which looks a lot like wheat when it first uh, sprouts up, and so that becomes the context of the story. So it uh, becomes clear eventually that uh, this bad seed has been sown, and we have the story picking up. Uh, Pros el Fontes from Prosercomai, I come to. This is an aorist participle. It's in the uh, nominative, plural, masculine. The subject of the participle, hoi douloi, the slaves, postpositive da, so but the slaves, uh, and then it's uh, two of the oiko despotu. This is from uh, oikos, house, and then the despotes. Uh, is the uh, root of this noun. Despotes is declined like mathetes or prophetes. Uh, the oiko dos, uh, despotes. A despot is uh, the way we bring it over to English, but it's not quite that uh, uh, harsh in Greek. It simply means the ruler, the householder. So the slaves of the householder having come, post positive de, uh, apon. Uh, third person plural, aorist active indicative of a lego, I say, they said, auto, indirect object, to him. Dative singular masculine, curiae, vocative of curios, lord or sir. Uki, uh, introducing here a question, and uh, it's uh, posing a, a question in the negative, did not, would be the idea, kalon, good, sperma, seed. Uh, was it not good seed? Espe Ross. Uh, this is the second person singular uh, aorist active indicative of spero to sow. So did you not sow? Uh, good seed in preposition with the dative to agro in the field. Uh, then so is the uh, second person dative uh, pronoun. So in the of you agro. This is a possessive pronoun. Uh, gives a little bit of uh, additional emphasis. It's a rather emphatic uh, idea in the of you, your field. Didn't you sow in your field? Good seed. Pothen. This is uh, a, a conjunction. Whence. Introducing a question. Un. A post positive. Therefore. Whence. Therefore. Eke. It has. From echo. I have. Zizania. Uh, these tares. These uh, poisonous weeds that are growing up. Uh, uh, with the uh, wheat. Uh, how is it that these, this poisonous kind of uh, uh, produce is beginning to uh, show itself here in light of the fact that the landowner had sown a good seed? And of course it becomes a, a parable about the nature of the church and how the church will sometimes have these uh, destructive forces working within, but sometimes it's hard to distinguish what is destructive from what is constructive.